Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I've had an outrageously fun two days at Mike Jones' house, right across the street, right next to Gentry and Brittany's house. And uh, I have to say the roof rail is now completely finished. I hesitate showing this to you because I know there are some people that, that just have a hard time visualizing things until they're completely done. And as you can see, it's not painted and stained yet. This one piece of red oak right here will be stained. It will be stained to match that, which is ebonized wood. Everything else, including the ends of these uh, mortise and tenon pieces, will be uh, painted. So they'll all be painted. This will be a wall color, though. This will be a trim color. The painting colors are still kind of up in the air. But anyway, I'm proud to show you this is the completed roof rail. Bird's eye view from the staircase going into the French doors. All right, first swoosh. Detail above the windows. Watch this. Ha <laughs> ha, right? Were we right about that? That looks that that by the way is the is the bathroom door. If you live in phase one or two of Mount Laurel, you have 200 pound interior doors that are solid wood. Okay, here's the uh, 1905 mantle. I bought that at an auction, at Hilltop Montessori School. Little plug for them. It's a TV cabinet, actually. It's going to be. A, the, the, I'm going to tile in there, but the TV will be on a telescoping arm right there uh, so you can put a picture of a fire if you're one of those people that has to have a picture of a fire okay so here is the roof rail as it goes around the top i'm trying not to show you how messy the house is it really is a catastrophe of messiness but anyway there's the roof rail 128 pieces a modified gustav stickley design i'm very very proud of it and one more pass past the two swishes I can't say it's easy to do, but the end product is really worth it. God bless you. Have a great day.